Ouida is a city located in the Republic of Benin, a country in West Africa. It is situated on the coast of the Gulf of Guinea and is approximately 40 kilometers west of the country's largest city, Kotanu. Ouida is known for its rich history and cultural heritage, making it a popular destination for tourists. One of the main attractions in Ouida is its historical significance as a major center of the slave trade during the 18th and 19th centuries. The city was a key port for the exportation of enslaved Africans to the Americas. Today, visitors can explore the Route des Esclaves, slave route, which was designated as a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1995. This route takes visitors through the former slave market, the Tree of Forgetfulness, and the Door of No Return, symbolizing the painful history of the transatlantic slave trade. In addition to its historical significance, Ouida is also known for its vibrant voodoo, voodoo, culture. Voodoo is a traditional religion practiced by a significant portion of the population in Benin, and Ouida is considered one of its spiritual centers. The city hosts the annual Voodoo Festival, attracting visitors from around the world who come to witness colorful ceremonies, traditional dances, and rituals associated with the religion. Ouida is also home to several important cultural and historical sites. The Ouida Museum of History showcases artifacts and exhibits related to the city's past, including the slave trade and the voodoo religion. The Temple of Pythons is another popular attraction, where visitors can see hundreds of pythons coexisting peacefully with humans, as they are considered sacred in voodoo culture. Furthermore, Ouida boasts beautiful beaches along the coast, providing opportunities for relaxation and water activities. The city's vibrant marketplaces offer a wide array of local crafts, artworks, and traditional clothing for visitors to explore and purchase as souvenirs. Overall, Ouida is a city that seamlessly blends its historical past with its vibrant cultural heritage. From its role in the slave trade to its significance in voodoo culture, Ouida offers visitors a unique and enriching experience that highlights the diversity and resilience of the people of Benin. Main Avatar August 28, 2023, 8 hours 27 minutes and 19 seconds p.m. Give complete information about Tempu in paragraph form. Main Avatar August 28, 2023, 8 hours 27 minutes and 33 seconds p.m. Tempu is the capital city of Bhutan, a landlocked country located in the eastern Himalayas. Nestled in a picturesque valley, Tempu is known for its unique blend of traditional Bhutanese culture and modern development. With a population of around 100,000, it is the largest city in Bhutan and serves as the political, economic, and cultural hub of the country. One of the main attractions in Tempu is its stunning natural beauty. Surrounded by lush green mountains, the city offers breathtaking views and numerous hiking trails for outdoor enthusiasts. Visitors can explore the nearby forests and enjoy the tranquility of nature while discovering Bhutan's diverse flora and fauna. Tempu is also home to numerous cultural landmarks and religious sites. One of the most iconic landmarks is the Tishai Chazong, a majestic fortress that serves as the seat of the Bhutanese government. This impressive structure showcases traditional Bhutanese architecture and houses several important administrative offices and religious institutions. Another must-visit site in Tempu is the National Memorial Chorton, a stupa built in honor of the third king of Bhutan. It is a popular place for locals and tourists to offer prayers and circumambulate the shrine. The Chang'anka Lakang, a 12th-century temple perched on a hilltop, is another significant religious site that offers panoramic views of the city. Tempu also offers a glimpse into Bhutanese arts and crafts. The city has several art galleries and museums that showcase traditional Bhutanese paintings, sculptures, and textiles. The Folk Heritage Museum provides insight into the daily life of the Bhutanese people, while the National Textile Museum displays a rich collection of textiles and weaving techniques. The city's vibrant marketplaces, such as the Centenary Farmers Market and the Handicrafts Market, offer a wide range of local produce, handicrafts, and souvenirs. Visitors can experience the lively atmosphere and interact with friendly locals while exploring the unique Bhutanese crafts and cuisine. Tempu also hosts various festivals throughout the year, including the Tempu Chechu, which is a colorful religious festival featuring masked dances, traditional music, and cultural performances. This is a great opportunity for visitors to immerse themselves in Bhutanese traditions and witness the vibrant cultural heritage of the country. Overall, Tempu is a captivating city that seamlessly blends tradition and modernity. With its natural beauty, cultural landmarks, and warm hospitality, Tempu offers visitors a unique and memorable experience that showcases the essence of Bhutanese culture and way of life. Paro is a picturesque town located in the Paro Valley of Bhutan, a landlocked country nestled in the eastern Himalayas. 
Known for its natural beauty and rich cultural heritage, Paro is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Bhutan. The town is surrounded by lush green mountains, crystal clear rivers, and breathtaking landscapes, making it a paradise for nature lovers and outdoor enthusiasts. One of the main attractions in Paro is the iconic Paro Taktasang, also known as the Tiger's Nest Monastery. Perched precariously on a cliffside, this sacred monastery is Bhutan's most famous landmark. It is believed to be the place where Guru Rinpoche, the patron saint of Bhutan, meditated in a cave in the 8th century. Visitors can hike up to the monastery, taking in stunning views along the way, and explore its ornate temples and meditation halls. Paro is also home to several other significant religious sites. The Paro Zong, also known as Rinpung Zong, is a fortress monastery that dates back to the 17th century. It is an architectural masterpiece with intricately painted walls and houses administrative offices, as well as religious institutions. The Qi Chu Lakong, one of the oldest temples in Bhutan, is another must-visit site that is believed to have been built in the 7th century. In addition to its cultural landmarks, Paro offers opportunities for adventure and exploration. The town is a gateway to the stunning Paro Valley, which is dotted with traditional Bhutanese farmhouses and terraced fields. Visitors can embark on scenic hikes, horseback riding, or mountain biking trails to explore the surrounding countryside and experience the tranquility of Bhutan's rural life. Paro also hosts several festivals throughout the year, including the Paro Chechu, a vibrant religious festival that showcases traditional mask dances, music, and cultural performances. This festival is a celebration of Bhutanese traditions and offers a unique insight into the country's rich cultural heritage. The town of Paro itself offers a charming atmosphere with its traditional Bhutanese architecture, colorful buildings, and friendly locals. Visitors can stroll through the streets, browse local shops and markets for handicrafts and souvenirs, and savor delicious Bhutanese cuisine in the town's restaurants and cafes. Overall, Paro is a captivating destination that combines natural beauty, cultural landmarks, and warm Bhutanese hospitality. With its stunning landscapes, ancient monasteries, and vibrant festivals, Paro offers visitors an unforgettable experience that truly captures the essence of Bhutan's unique and enchanting culture. Punaka is a scenic town located in the Punaka Valley of Bhutan, a landlocked country nestled in the eastern Himalayas. Situated at a lower altitude than many other parts of Bhutan, Punaka enjoys a relatively mild climate and is known for its lush vegetation and fertile agricultural lands. The town holds great historical and cultural significance, as it was the capital of Bhutan until 1955. One of the main attractions in Punaka is the Punaka Zong, also known as the Palace of Great Happiness. This majestic fortress monastery is one of the most beautiful and well-preserved Di Zongs in Bhutan. Built in the 17th century, it is located at the confluence of the Phu Chu and Mo Chu rivers, adding to its scenic charm. The Punaka Zong houses important religious relics, administrative offices, and is the venue for the coronation of Bhutan's kings. Another notable site in Punaka is the Chimi Lakong, also known as the Fertility Temple. This small temple is dedicated to the divine madman, Drukpa Kunli, who is believed to have used unorthodox methods to spread Buddhism. The temple is a popular pilgrimage site for couples seeking blessings for fertility and is adorned with colorful phallus paintings and symbols. Punaka is also known for its beautiful natural landscapes. The Punaka Valley is blessed with terraced fields, fruit orchards, and scenic views of the surrounding mountains. Visitors can explore the valley on foot or by bike, enjoying the fresh air and tranquility of the countryside. The nearby Mo Chu River offers opportunities for whitewater rafting, adding an adventurous element to the visit. The town of Punaka itself offers a glimpse into traditional Bhutanese architecture and way of life. Visitors can wander through the streets, lined with traditional houses adorned with intricate wood carvings and colorful paintings. The town's marketplaces offer a variety of local products, including handicrafts, textiles, and fresh produce. Punaka also hosts several festivals throughout the year, including the Punaka Chechu. This vibrant religious festival showcases traditional mask dances, music, and cultural performances, attracting both locals and tourists. The festival is a celebration of Bhutanese traditions and provides a unique opportunity to immerse oneself in the country's rich cultural heritage. Overall, Punaka is a captivating destination that seamlessly blends natural beauty, historical landmarks, and Bhutanese traditions. With its stunning dizongs, fertile valleys, and warm hospitality, Punaka offers visitors a memorable and enriching experience that truly captures the essence of Bhutan's unique and enchanting culture.